Hello everyone, this is ASMR Studio welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorial and today I'll show you the face retouch and the face perfection like the uh, lips and the eyes and other stuffs. So if I analyze the photo here and the lips color and here is the lips color and skin color here and here before and after and the eye color before and after all the stuffs of uh, beauty retouch if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications okay at first i'm going to the file and open up here is my image and i got this image from the client so i'm just retouching this one and i'll show the process what we'll have to do so at first make copy by pressing ctrl j and after that i'll go to the filter and the photo toolbox and skin finer from here i'll adjust the color of the face okay if i zoom it in i'll show yeah here the here is some spots of the face but in this photo there is no spot on the face so if you need you can change the smoothing you can change the fining how fine will be the face and here the hue and saturation that means the skin tone if you need you can change the skin tone like that or like that so i'll make the skin tone a little bit like that and the saturation if you need you can edit the saturation if i make it in like plus and minus so i'll make this one minus eight that's fine and here is the brightness if you need you can change this one and contrast as well so i'll make the contrast like that just because of shadow and highlighting that's the most important thing in the retouching or portrait photography so shadow if you need you can add the shadow or decrease the shadow so i'll add a little bit shadow here and the highlight i'll increase the highlight a little bit up and hit the ok button so it take time and yeah the before one and after one so smooth skin so before one and after one so now i'll adjust the now i'll adjust the like uh, lips color so how to do that just go to the pen tool and draw the lips like this so at first the upper lips and draw carefully when you are drawing this please concentrate here and make it zoom so here you have to be careful the area of the lips so here here and here so you have to be careful when you are just uh, drawing the lips here and here the upper portion so right press and make selection and hit ok and then press ctrl j it will make another layer so select this one just select another color from the color palette suppose pick color from here and you can choose the color from here and hit ok and alter delete and then press ctrl d for the deselect and then go to the blending mode and make it overlay and reduce the opacity a little bit if you need according to the lips yeah that's fine so upper upper lips is uh, done and now again go to the lower lips so select here and select carefully of the area of the lips and here as well so if you make the selection more precisely your photo will be more precise so you have to be careful when you are selecting the lips area so that's good and this portion this portion and this portion as well and just match with that right press and make selection and hit ok and then again press ctrl j and select press the ctrl button and select this one and just press alter delete and then right press go to the blending mode and overlay options and in this i'm just given here 73 opacity 73 and the flow that is the 66% then I'll make it 66% 
so let's see the before one and after one before one and after one okay now i'll select all the things here make group and make it merge and now i will add another shadow and highlight here and then i'll work with the eye color so take a new blank layer and make this one reset and take a brush tool and make it white and brush tool brush that is the size that is the according to the cornea i'll take the size yeah and hardness zero percent and just select once here and select once here make sure that the opacity and flow is 100 percent and go to the blending mode and make it overlay and if you need you can change the flow okay that's fine and merge it okay after merging that i will add the extra light and shadow so press ctrl j and j two layers another is for the highlight and another one is for shadow so i'm turning off the shadow at first highlight i will work with that and make it a screen right press blending options and then underlining layer press the alter button the slider will divide and find out the highlighted area of the face yeah that's fine and hit ok and mask it image and apply image and hit ok so select this one again the shadow layers make it multiply blending mode and blending options from here this slider is for the shadow slider and press the alter button and find out the shadow from the face and hit ok mask it same process image apply image but in this case make it invert and hit ok select these two layer make it group and make it mask image and apply image uncheck the invert option and hit ok see the changes the highlighted and shadow area will be prominent so before one and after one now just select these two things and then go to the adjustment layer and the solid color i'll take a warm color which will make the photo like uh, more warmy so after taking the color go to the blending mode and make it soft light so if you need you can select the color which is like a little bit warmy or uh, other stuff so here the face faces things so if you need yeah that's good so before one and after one before that was the ordinary normal and non-edited image and after one you are getting this one so this one is pretty good and easy to make your retouch options or retouch thing so if you need the plugins please check out my video description if you have any kind of question please do comment on my video comment section what kind of tutorial you want in the next um, episode please do comment on my video comment section and until the next video i am asmr signing out today bye bye